Yo, yo. Hold on. This is a part of the weekly update thing for the G Zone. Um, I don't know what to say other than the fact that like I'm not doing being uh, I've been doing a lot lately. Uh, reasons for this? Reasons for this is because streaming it, it takes it out on you when you got like a full-time job or partly a full-time job, kind of a full-time job. I still get three-day week weekends. Um, I came to a point when I was trying to stream, like, there's games like Mass Effect Andromeda right now. <sighs> Final Fantasy 15. Oh, I'm all sticky and gross. And Breath of the Wild. I kept saying to, my, my girlfriend came up to me and said, when are you going to play Mass Effect next? I said, um, Monday. This was like, I was saying this on a, a Friday afternoon. Oh, it'd be Monday by the time I play it next. And she said, why is that? Cause, because I wanted to stream it for viewers, I wanted to get people in there, I wanted to see if they were Mass Effect fans. I wanted to see if there was Mass Effect fans who were willing to come in and talk to me about the game and stuff. I was doing two hour streams at a pop and they were empty, lonely. This camera is not going to be standing still, stupid tripod. So then I kind of said, well, I'm going to quit streams for games like Mass Effect, like Final Fantasy XV and Zelda Breath of the Wild because I enjoy more in my own time. Like they're games to be taken in in my own time, and I love spending like time in bed playing Zelda or using the, the the Nintendo Switch, which is an amazing, amazing piece of tech. I've got an unboxing video which I currently need to get on and edit, but it's quarter past two in the day, and I'm just not getting around to. Hey, this place is a freaking mess. I still got like birthday cards, Valentine's cards, beer mats. I don't know what they're doing there. Um, portable chargers charging, which have been fully charged for. Well, I don't know when it did it. I don't even remember that being in there. Headsets on the floor, clothes. There's a pile of friggin' clothes. God damn it! Juggling balls. Don't ask. Wii U is in a is in a heap on the floor. I need to Hoover. There's cat hair. There's more headsets. Which now it's stuck to me. Dust. This dust. This here. My PS4. I don't know if you can see that. There's a Gears of War book <laughs> either side to keep it out because I thought that like it was vibrating like mad when I was streaming Andromeda and uh, that's not really an issue now, is it? Because I'm not streaming it. I am still streaming three main games. Three main games. That one of them. Mondays. Mondays is our Rocket League night. No, you blew him up. Pass it. Pass it. <laughs> oh. What are you doing? Oh my god. <laughs> Beautiful. I joined Call Me and Matt5464 for um for those. Uh, we just have a laugh for three hours and uh, it's been quite good actually. It's been a fair few viewers coming in regularly. Uh, there's also Tuesdays, Tuesday night, tonight's Tuesday night, maybe by the time you see this, which I'm, I'm going to try and keep up to date with my update videos every Wednesday. Tuesdays, being Overwatch. Tuesdays, Overwatch night. She could take me out. Mercy could take me out right now. Doesn't seem to want to. Get back here. No, come on. Why can't I? I'm terrible. Wednesdays, we're gonna. I'm gonna start bringing back the Mario Maker. That's my Mario Maker. Is the um... just try and rush on through it. <laughs> the most stressful stream ever. Always under pressure, but it's always fun. And there's loads of loads of guys coming in for that. Give me their codes for their levels. So I'm gonna stick to doing that. And Saturday. Saturday's a non and off one. Saturdays I may do a stream of anything I really feel like. But yeah, sorry that it's been rather quiet on the channel. I do want to, besides doing unboxing videos, I've got a bit more light. In between the streams I'll be trying to do some other little things. I, I'm running out of ideas, I'm not. Like I've been doing this for over a year now. And I, you know, when you feel like you're not going anywhere. You don't feel like you're going anywhere, but you, you kind of are going somewhere, but then you kind of not at the same time. You I mean you don't know, and you get so confused, and you don't know what to do, you don't know what to do with this one thing. 
this, that, what's popular, what's actually bringing in the views, what do I actually want to do. Nothing, I, I'm, I'm not happy with anything. First things first, this shit together like in here that I'm saying about how tidy this up. I've got beer bottles over here. And by the way guys, Dead Pony. Dead Pony Club is a real nice beer. It's very light, it's only 3.8%, but it's a good beer. It's, I haven't said that, also from Brewdog, Elvis Juice. Elvis Juice is amazing. Oh yeah, EGX tickets. I don't know if there's any information on there I shouldn't be sharing with you, possibly that. EGX tickets, press passes for all four days. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, we're gonna have to book a hotel, maybe like a Premier Inn or something, me and Reclusive Fox. That's gonna be fun because that means we're not gonna be doing everything all in one go on the Thursday, Friday, which I mean to cram the entire I suppose you could do it, but like, I want to have a bit more of a relaxing time at EGX rather than just going around mad. There's also another thing, I promised part two of EGX from last year that I never ever got around to editing. I do apologise, it's never going to happen. What the heck is this? No, I thought it was Royal Mail, I thought there was another delivery going on, I don't know what it could be. Dog's barking, he's not here, it's not, it's not for us. I'm going off anyway, this light's too bright now, this is hurting my eyes. Uh, that's kind of an update. I'm going to try and keep up to date with the update. Every Wednesday, I record it every Tuesday, bring it up every Wednesday. Do you know where I'm at and what I'm doing? And what I... Just anything me. Well, of course, I want to hear from you guys what you think what I should be getting on with. And I, if you've got a channel of your own, or you uh, feel really... Um, you're not deciding on what you really want from it. Try and gather up together and see, like, um, give ideas, give hints to guys, tips and whatnot. I mean, a year on in, people say to me, you've got nearly 430 videos and only 160 viewers. At the end of the day, I was, uh, this really pissed me off the other day on Twitter, there was a, a group of s streamer supports, which is fair enough, it's always good to like, support streamers, but what you're getting essentially at the end of the day is just a simple retweet on Twitter and a follow on Twitter, a platform which really, it doesn't matter, especially if streamers are meeting streamers, because at the end of the day, these streamers are streaming themselves, they are trying to get themselves out there, and then they're trying to help you do so, so you're not really meeting anyone, you're not bringing in new viewers in the slightest, and at the end of the day, they want followers or subscribers from YouTube to boost numbers so sub for subs follow for follows that kind of crap what's the worth what is the worth the viewer worth you <laughs> know if they're not actually going to be viewing you and they're just giving you a number like they're just that's not support in any way whatsoever at least with my 160 viewers I have Guys like Call Me, Matt, Andres, El Prick joins in for the Overwatch stuff. I mean, they're not only viewing my videos and my streams, but they are coming in to like join in with the fun. Playing Overwatch, playing Rocket League, anything, anything goes. That's support right there. So I think those guys. That's that, guys. I'm going to leave you there and we'll be further updated next week hopefully I can get my schedules up and running I just need to sort crap out and I'll tell you what I do need I, I need a new uh, tripod these gorilla pods we kinda got one that's a bit too small for this camera so it's very top heavy although even if it was top heavy that thing's very loose not very good who makes this? Joby Joby tripods don't buy them well buy a big one Buy a big sturdy one for your camera so it's not top heavy. And there it goes again. Oh, and again, one last thing to update. I know I was just about to close off Nintendo Switch. I really wanted to stream, I really wanted to um, do some videos for Fast RMX, which is a Wipeout style uh, F Zero game. I'm loving that, I'm loving it. But when you have the Switch docked uh, so that HDMI comes up on monitors, you can't. Put your headphones into the uh, screen without losing the output sound through HDMI. So Elgato isn't capturing it. Um, 
You can hear the game yourself, but like no one else can hear the game. That's kind of a bummer, and the only way around it is if I get a brand new monitor. Brand new one of these. Which, I mean, these are great monitors. These are Asus, I can't remember what they're called. Some weird number thing. They're good screen quality, but like you can't use, there's no, there's no speakers, there's no audio jack 3.5 mil for headphones, so I was tempted to buy new ones just for that, but I don't think I'm going to bother them. I think at the end of the day, the Switch is a portable little device, which is amazing for your own enjoyment. You don't have to see it, guys. You've got other places to go see it. I might do some more future videos, especially when Mario, new Mario games come out and some Mario Kart stuff, because I'm, I've got plans for Mario Kart. I want to, uh, bring back something a little. Only a few of you know what I'm talking about. I was about to say kinda. Quinder. That's quite and kinder. Quinder. I think that's gonna be quinder fun. Laters! Whoa, look! They sound insane. And they're ca casting a horrible shadow as well. Why did the players do nothing? He's just staring at him and waiting for him to go in! Mm -hmm.